Hey, um, Jeremiah here. Little project we're working on. Thought I'd let you guys in. I looked all over the internet to see if I could find a video on people switching out straw walkers and, and finishing sieves on all crop combines. And I couldn't because I needed to do it. So I already forgot to video a lot of it. But we'll pick up here and, and go from go from there. So what I got here is I've got a 72 uh, behind me that's in a lot of ways in nice shape. It's got the scour clean on it. And we're gonna get into making some seeds, some, some clover seed and buckwheat, some of the specialty crops, stuff like that. Uh, we're all certified organic. And then there we've got a, I had a 66, a big bin that had a lot of nice parts in it, but it was just rusting out. So I'm kind of combining the two to make a uh, make a good machine. And so what we had was we had the 72 had kind of a busted straw walker, although it was welded up decent. But then the the sieve at the bottom was was not in good shape at all. So we've got those taken out now. And what we did for the straw walker, it was easy. The bolts the bolts inside here. I mean, let me see they go in there on the rocker arms they they came right out that went really good and then you unhook the other end and then this just lifts out nice and easy the finishing sieve was a little more complicated because the casting on the bracket sticks out out of the holes so we had to spring the sides in to slide it out but it didn't go too bad it went pretty good um so then I've got them out of the 66 also. Uh, what I got in here when I found was my uh, grain return table here, whatever you call this. On the 72 is, is shot. It's wore all the way through and the chains are actually riding on the wood on the sides. The one on the 66 in great shape. So I'm going to switch that too. And then also in the 72, if you can see in the back, there's... It's kind of tore up there at the top of the fan. And again, on the 66, that's that piece is in nice shape. So I think I'm going to go ahead and switch the fans and get those pieces in there nice. I'm concerned that it looks like I've got to take that rocker bar like all the way out to get these wood pieces that that metal's on. Um, that's what it looks like. I don't know, but I'm going to find out. So... We all, we'll we'll work along here and kind of just keep you updated, I guess. All right.